Hey everybody, I'm Sir Tap Tap, and this is Black Room, a narrative experience about falling asleep while on your computer on the internet. Relatable. So, read me. Black Room is a game about your browser. So this is a browser game. Uh, game design test and blah blah. Allow pop-ups. Okay. Allow how to how how shut no shut face. Um, allow pop-ups. Allow. Okay. Hopefully that won't be too- <laughs> Look at this amazing URL, by the way. This is the real URL. Real. <laughs> net. Must be for Hugga God's cousin. Anyway. This is a somewhat heavy game, and speed will depend on your graphics card and internet connection. Okay, you know, let's just play. It looks like a very graphics-heavy game for that intro. I'm sorry, it might not be perfectly centered. Uh, actually, let me... Let me see if I can center this a bit better. Center to screen. Oh, no. A little bit better, but there we go. Okay. Flamingos. So that's nice. Got a mystic orb of demonic influence. Or demonic influence, if you prefer. It's thrumbing down the spheres. Oh, no! They exploded. And then, then we exist. I hate when I exist, don't you? Arrow keys. Oh, okay. All right. I'm liking this, like, 1995. What is this music? I could swear for a moment I heard, like, an old computer starting up. Like, startup noise thing. So this is what it's like when you fall asleep on your computer. There's 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 demon spheres floating through the sky, and some lovely stars. Oh, I love this aesthetic. It looks it, it looks like um those like online like pixely games from like like I said like ninety. Well, maybe ninety five is a little too early, but you know. Um, what am I thinking of? Not exactly RuneScape. RuneScape had an art style. Like, RuneScape, I think, was like... What, isn't RuneScape technically 3D? It just looks like crap. But, like, there's some... Um, early pixely online garbage portals like this. So, London is on fire. All right, there's the Leaning Tower of Pisa, but I think that's in London, right? I mean, they, they corrected, they, they made multiples and stood them up. Yes, hello? Have you come to interrupt me again, Parker? So I don't know if this is like random kind of like LSD dream emulator or, oh, I'm red. That's my attack. <laughs> those are from Castlevania, you can't fool me. You can't fool me, those, those candles in the background, I think the candles in the, those are some Castlevania stuff, whoa. There's some, some sparkles. So. Yeah, I figured there'd be some... Actually, is this character from Castlevania? It kind of matches the art style, but I don't recognize them specifically. Water droplets fall on your shoulders. Okay, I think that's just like a... You know, I don't think you can interact with that. I assume the graphics are ripped from various, you know, pixel art things. This game conceived as a feminist dungeon crawler features a major majority female cast of video game sprites from the 90s or from the 1970s to current day. Okay, so that does explain things. What is this? Oops. Sorry, I'm fidgeting with things. What? What is this? Am I not? Oh, hello. Hi. Oh, this game has never worked. Oh. It leads me all over the place. It only creates other rooms. I'm sorry if the text is a little small in the video. The game it's a big window thing. Do I have to click? I guess I gotta exit out. Open window. This is what the future was back whoa, 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 whoa. The cement floor cold to the touch. Is that me? Am I that thing? Am I the, the, the use and do- I think that's me, maybe? 
Let's open up a window. <laughs> net dot net says a glittering sky. Okay. Open window was a very literal action. I click the chair and it, it just fades out of existence. Oops, oops. We're, we're expecting the element. A cement floor cold to the touch. I don't want... I don't want cement floor. Open the open another window. Open two windows. That's not even a pop. That's like a... Blinking, you find yourself in a dark room. You stumble forward, your fingers searching for something solid. Resize the browser to find hidden items. Oh, oh, okay. Okay, hidden items. Oh. What is this? What? Okay. I'm glad I used um, a display capture thing for this. What is this? I see the black chair. I try to place it relationally to the black table. By the time I imagine the table, the chair is gone. I reimagine the chair. There's no longer a room, but a hallway. I'm walking through it. As I walk, the hallway becomes an ocean, and I'm awake again to rearrange the room. A book. We got a book. This kind of reminds me of everything is going to be okay. This is just... Oh, you know what? This reminds me also of... Um... Um, Vinny from Vine Sauce played this ridiculous garbage from, like, 1993. It was, like, the museum of anything goes, and there would just be, like, video clips and garbage. Oh. Paradise. Very... <laughs> okay. It just opens up a Google search to paradise. Table. T chair. A black folding... What? You can buy... This 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 video sponsored by this eighty nine dollar black folding chair from Sam's Club. W would you pay eighty eight dollars for that? Oh, it's a four pack. Okay, that's much more reasonable. I was like, that is not an eighty dollar chair, honey. Dry air. There's a maze at the top if you wanna you know get out your pencils. Uh, wait, what's this? Dry air. Uh, yeah. So let, let me guess. Yep, smeekrits. More smeekrits. You gotta find the smeekrit. I don't really need this. This was... The game opens to this, and it's just a URL to the actual thing. Um, I, uh, there was no reason for me to install it, so to speak. So let's just close that. And uh, what is that? My mother taught me this game. Which her mother taught her. A trick for falling asleep. I need to please my mother. I played the game. But I can never hold more than a couple of furnishings before having to start over. I must be talking about Animal Crossing. I hate that 20 item limit. That's just annoying. I see I see things going on there. Let's open the window. Whoa. Oh, it's sweet smelling night air. Oh. I like the vibe. Whoa! I see you wingdings. Or webdings, whichever one that is. Um, there's some beautiful flowers. There's a wreath. There's a heart wreath of beautiful roses. Strange scent of lilacs. Okay, they're lilacs, but you know, cl close enough. Um, chair. No, the chair. <laughs> My, the main character has problems with, with furniture. Oh, it's a spooky window. Okay. Okay, then. A spooky window. Understood. Where's the smeekrit? Guys, I gotta find no w window. No, I need. I hate when it like. Ugh. No, let me grab the edge. Okay, G secret. If you can't grab the cor grab the corner, it's um, easier to. Oh, there we go. <laughs> I like this. Is an interesting use of responsive design. I've never thought of uh, using it like as a like game mechanic. Like that's pretty cool. I was sure there was a winning of the game. My stress became more when I remembered I had forgotten a chair or a vase in the corner. What is this game? Why can't I hold the room together? Is that not the point of the game? Is this some, like, thing that people do, by the way? Like, I, th I feel like I'm missing something. Is this, like, a common thing where people try to, like, envision, like, interior decorations in their brain and it puts them to sleep? Like, is that some altered version of the thing where you count sheep? Whoa! Hello, face lady. You're missing a few lines of, uh, face, but that's fine. Can you hear... Is this recording the... Okay, it is. 
Just say the music, the, the, the audio is so quiet that the, the it doesn't show up in my uh, audio rendering. Like it kind of does, but so there's a tree there. If you want, you want some tree, I can get you some tree. Vase, we got. You know, it's a two for one bargain. Vase and tree. You buy the tree, get the vase absolutely free, no money down. I'm not screwing around here. This deal is not for anybody but you. Memories of different rooms. KSR. Okay. Can't can't do the furniture. I want to do things with the furniture, but it won't let me. Oh, I see. Got a bloop. What is this? What? There we go. It's like a pipe. Have you paid the Pied Piper? There we go. I let myself leave the room if I feel calm enough. Instead of leading me to other rooms then, I find myself disappeared to a paved street. Something in the palm fronds, like ribbons or debris or animals. You know, you could easily mistake any of those three things for any of the other of the three. You know, ribbons, debris, animals. Who knows? I return. I'm in the room again, holding a flower. A white one. Okay. I don't know how long this is, by the way. Does this say... I just don't know if I should be splitting this. There's some ridiculous stuff that I am not seeing. I really, I really like, I think, I forget if Ichio lets you, I think Ichio lets you tell you people how long a game is, and I don't, um, I don't know if this game tells you that. There's some really interesting gifts and stuff going on in the, uh, in the, uh, situation. The, the Ichio description. So I don't know how many videos, whoa. In Dusty Prairie, an alien plant grows. That's a good plant. It's, it's, you're showing me the secret though. I see those legs. This stream is, or this video is banned from like the 1920s. You can't, if you have a time machine and you go back to the 1920s with this video, you would be arrested and sent to prison because those legs. Oh, we're going on a horse ride, guys. Something about this perspective is making me nauseous, like, oh, it's not even, it's harshly. It's like, something is like, almost like undulating, like, it just doesn't feel like an even ride. I, I want to get off the, I want to get off Mr. Bone's wild ride. I want to get off Steph. Steph, okay. What is this? It's a little moth friend. Hello, moth friend. I see that necklace. Whoa. Why is the necklace not hidden? What is that? Oh, it's a jellyfish. Is this... Well, well, thanks for watching my Let's Play of Yumi Nikki, everybody. Uh, that sure was an ending, wasn't it? <laughs> Hopefully people will get that. Hello. Oh, whoa. Oh, oh, banned. Banned. Oh, I'm banned. I'm so banned from every... From everything. Oh, what are these? Even more banned than the legs. The legs were most of the banning, but but also the, the bubbies. Hello. Is that like the Martian thing from... from? Or no, the Martian things are like birds. I'm thinking of... There's something vaguely like that in Looney Tunes, I think. Anyway, I can obviously tell... Wait. A field of irises at sunset. Thank you. <laughs> there's something interesting about it, like actually linking you to stuff. Like It just actually sends you to links. I think this is the last click we're gonna do. Oh. I think this is the last click. There we go. We're gonna do in this video. We're gonna go ahead to another video, I guess. I don't know how long this is, so I don't know how many videos to make. Which is always a concern, but... The blackness of the room is nauseating. Whoa, hello, voice crack. Hello, I'm, I, am I 15? I think I'm 15, guys. I think it's supposed to play in the back of eyelids. Darkness is supposed to be a comfort to invoke sleep. Leaves me paranoid and forgetful. How can I place things if I can't see them? Where does my body belong in this room? Apparently belongs right there. Look at that. Look at that. That is... Oh, this video is so banned. That's right, Parker. Whoa. Check out those 90s water effects. That is some good stuff. A webbed mound in a field of snow. That's right, Parker. It's a webbed mound. I love webbed mounds. That's right. That's right! Yes! Yes! What will this, what will this show us? 
some, with some goldfish in a koi pond or something. I don't know what those are. Mer! I know, Parker. I, I know. I always wanted one of these things. Ah! But, uh, upkeep and stuff. Uh, there's a lot of little thingers. Beautiful white flowers everywhere. <laughs> what an unusual way to tell a story. I, I like it. Um, whoa. Webbed mound. Okay, that's the webbed mound. We've seen the web. Oh! A blurred figure at the bottom of the sea. Alright. So next time we will go to the next thing or dinger. So this this is Black Room and I, I'm liking where this is going. I, I do wish I knew how long this was. So I know how many videos I'm be making, but I definitely want to see through to this. This is this is really interesting. Oh wait, what's this? I I've been forgetting to click to this. As your eyes continue to adjust you make out the cloud-like forms of pillows scattered over the floor. Resize the browser to find hidden items. So it's just kind of a rough description of the current room. You can't even see the, the question mark, can you? There's a question mark in the top right corner. Um, it just kind of seems to give a little bit of a hint. But yeah, this is Black Room, and I'm really enjoying this. As always, there's a link in the description to uh, the game I'm playing, and you can play it for yourself. This is free. It's like a browser thing. And, uh, yeah, can't wait for the next one. Or the next uh, video, which will be, you know, right now for me. But next day for you, if it's the first day. Stop talking. Tap, tap. The video's over.